Hey everybody, this is Banana Joe, and we're back with a new GM mode. Sorry I haven't uploaded in a while. I have literally been doing schoolwork up the butt, so that's why I haven't been keeping up with videos and shit. Alright, so we're going to do the Chicago Blackhawks, because they're my favorite team, of course, and for reasons, like, they're kind of a... Re why is he still on? Oh yeah, he's on the team. They're at a stage where they don't have a lot of money, money left. So we're going to use them because after this year, they're going to have no one. They're going to have to let go of Lad, Hosa, all them, or one of them. Let me see in the system. I think Fleischman's in the system. Who's Harrison? Oh, we did trade Bickle. Fuck you, you fag. How much placement there he is. I want him up. His contract is nothing. Why the hell don't we have him up? So does Dennis Rasmussen. It's our Richard Ponick from Manchester, actually. Best lines. Oh, yeah. Alternate captain swag. Put Fleischman right here. Third line score, death forward. Alright, so we're just going to roll with this team for a while. And if this starts going wrong, I'm trading Hosa for a young player because I don't really like Hosa that much. So let's get first preseason. Oh, Alright, 5-1. to one. I don't like scouting in this game. It hasn't been good for me. Oh, injuries off, injuries off. We're fucking tearing it up though. I hate injuries. I already set up all the power play lines and like that, so if you guys are wondering why I didn't show them, I probably should, but I'm not going to. So we're lighting it up preseason against these amateurs. Why is Desjardin captain? What are they doing? Which is Bickle's contract? What? How does he have that much contract? His contract's like four million dollars. All right, we'll play him there, I guess. What are the fourth? Ah. Oh. All right, let's what? So the Hawks in real life haven't been doing good. So, yeah. That's I don't like how they're doing very bad. In real life, it's stupid. They should be doing good after acquiring Lad. I think they only won five games. All right, nice wins, nice wins. I'm I'm doing this because then the, we have one. No, there's going to be this one good year. And this year, and and then I'm doing a full rebuild and trading them, trading Hosa and Lad before they. Just retire and lad um contracts expire, so I'm gonna trade him at the deadline. Probably cause whatever you call it, it's cap. So we're doing good, five and two, and OT lost there, but that's a point, so I really don't care. Ice hogs are killing it down there. And then we're like the real hogs. We go on these weird stretches that just don't make any sense. Like, Crawford might be letting in weak ones, or, like, is it because our team's not scoring enough goals? God, Rockford, 11-1. Rockford, come on, win another one. Oh my god, Rockford's killing it up. Look at the NHL team. 
Oh, they lost in overtime, and then they won. I know, they lost in overtime. See what they do with that game right here. So we win against San Jose. We have an even record, but we lose in a OT. Ten. Oh my god, team, pick it up. Is this the whole West? Dismiss morale right now. I don't need to talk to any of you frick heads. We'll go to the All-Star break. Shall win. Nice, gotta win. 26 and 1. Without lad? Bullcrap. OT. Oh my god, stop losing. Can we only beat good teams? Like, seriously. Look at this team is gonna be below average and we're gonna win. Or above average, I mean. Edmonton. God. How do you want and wanna. I bet Patrick Kane's performing well. 8-5 loss. What a game. Against Dallas. We should light Niami up. Or Lettinen. Come on. Good player morale. Yeah, fucking... We're gonna end at the All-Star break. Because I haven't been video videoing for a while, so my throat kind of sore from talking so much, actually. I don't know why it is. Maybe because I just got back from school. Win, win. How about we're going to win against the Avalanche? No, I fucking hate Andrew Ference. I love when he flicked off all those cameras. I think it was against Montreal. I'm going to a Montreal game this year. And I'm going to a Cubs game. I might videotape that. Me and Cubs fan for life 26 are going. Or one. I don't know what he is on the fucking YouTube. PlayStation, he's 26, so. I'm going to go with my gut and do two. All right, our team isn't that bad. Good play morale. Yeah, we're on the ball. When are we on the ball, Biatch? All right, we're in second place. Thought we were being something else. Who the fuck are all these players? Duncan Keith, what? He's leading the team in scoring. He must be slumping this year. No, that's actually pretty good. I bet he's leading all defensemen. Not in the East. What is the most points in the NHL? Jamie Benn lighting up the league and scoring. 63 points. Who's behind him? Corey Sagan, of course. Keith's up there. Defenseman. Yeah, Duncan Keith has a 10 point lead on the highest one. Check out goalies. Crawford in the win. Goals against average. Shutouts. Mark Andre Fleury, six shutouts. Jesus. Si oh my god. Um, anyone score points yet? Any, how many assists do we have? Most assists. Three assists? Corey Crawford putting up some points this year. Well, alright. We're gonna end this video off right now because my voice is getting a little bit sore. So, uh, see you guys in the next one, which will be coming out in a day or so.